Welcome to this tutorial on how to play Simple Song by Passenger. We're in standard tuning. We have a capo on our fifth fret. And this song, I'll just be teaching you what I played in the beginning of this tutorial, which is that introductory lick. So, we're going to start out here in kind of an F position. So you're going to have your index finger on the first fret of the B string, your ring finger on the third fret of the D. And we're going to hammer on to the second fret with our middle finger. So what we do is we start off by playing the open G, we hammer on with our middle finger to that 2nd fret, we play the 3rd fret of that D, we play the 1st fret of the B, which is what your index finger is on, we're going to move our pinky to the 3rd fret of the high E, and we're going to play that on the high E, and then we're going to drop our pinky and play open. So that first part sounds like this. Do that one more time here. So hammer on, third fret of the D, first fret of the B string, third fret of the high E, open E. Then we go to a C chord or a C shape. So your index is going to be on the first fret of the B, middle fingers, on the second fret of the D. And you're going to pluck the D and the B string simultaneously then the G, then the D, and then back to the G. So. so pluck the D and the B simultaneously, G, D, G strings. Okay, so stringing that together, we have this. And then next we're going to go to kind of a G shape. So we're going to put our ring finger on the 3rd fret of the low E string while our index is on the 1st fret of the B. And we're going to play the, e, the low E and the B string together simultaneously. And we're going to hammer on to the 3rd fret with our pinky over here. So after we hammer on to that 3rd fret with our pinky, we're going to play D, B, the D and the B strings, then you're going to play the D, G, high E, hold it for a second, then you're going to play your third fret on that B string again, and you're going to drop your pinky, and you're going to play the first fret. So that part sounds like this. And at full speed. all together it sounds like this. One more time. Okay, so then we go back to our F shape. Okay, so we're back on that F shape, and we're going to hammer on with our middle finger to that 2nd fret again. We're going to play our D and our G and our B string. Then we're going to play the G, and we're going to pull our finger off and play it again. So it sounds like this. So hammer on, play this D string, play your high B string, play this G string again. Take your finger off, play the G string one more time. So that part sounds like this. And we go back to our C. And we play the A and the B strings. And we strum, or we pick the G, D, G strings. And then it finishes out similarly to the first lick that we played there. So it's actually the exact same as what we had played um, in the first bar. So that second part sounds like this. So there's really just a minor variation, which is what you're doing with that F chord. So the first part sounds like this. And 
the second part sounds like this. And that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and play through those nice and slow here so you can um, have a little practice here and then that'll be it for this tutorial. So here's the first one again. That's it. So I went through that quickly. I know it's a little complicated. I'm not teaching the chords here and uh, getting the finger picking can be difficult, but go ahead and rewind as many times as you need. If you have other questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.